Okay, let's log in. This is your username and password you signed up with. Okay, we're at the membership page. Go to your subscription. Brings you to the members page. Click right click the area that you want to view. Save it to disk. Either to your desktop or your C drive. Okay, then find that file right click on it and say open with Google Earth and then it'll take a minute close the window down and it'll take a minute for Google Earth to open it's loading the files it's gonna ask you uh, to get the data from uh, freehuntingland.com servers in the protected area so you have to give your username and password again we can check that box so it'll always remember it and then it's loading the files okay the, here, here's the different layers of data the dark green is national forest the, the light green is county forest the orange is DNR managed lands the purple is um, managed forest law and the yellow is forest crop law. There's also some blue and black. The blue is kind of a mixed MFL uh, um, parcel. It's usually a small acre where maybe 10 is open and 30 is closed and then the black is closed. You can't hunt on the, the black squares. Okay, turning on different layers. You can also set the op opacity and transparency of each layer individually or the whole group as a whole. Once you kind of zoom in on where, where you want to hunt, it's nice to see the, the trees and the roads and the, the four-wheeler trails and the, the ponds and creeks and all that stuff that's important for hunting. You can see through the layer. So basically every one of these colored regions is public land. You can't find this anywhere else. All you know all five or six types of land together on one map interactive here we zoom zoomed in on an area of some county forest you can get close enough to see uh, individual trees uh, get a little closer you can see the shadows of the trees 